Under the right conditions, the double bond between carbon atoms and ethene molecules can be partially broken, allowing them to form links to one another via the formation of single covalent bonds in what is known as an addition reaction, resulting in the formation of long-chain molecules of polythene, commonly known as plastic, or more accurately, as a thermoplastic polymer. It is a polymer because it is made up of many individual units, or monomers, linked together in a repeating pattern. The exact number of monomer units in a strand of polythene can vary, but typically numbers in the thousands or tens of thousands. Depending upon the process used to produce polythene, the strands of polythene can be unbranched or branched, the unbranched strands pack closely together in crystalline formations to form high-density polythene, a strong material that can be used to make objects such as plastic toys, pipes and buckets. Branched polythene forms low-density polythene, a much more flexible material used to make cling film and plastic shopping bags. Polythene is thermoplastic. It softens upon heating as the weak intermolecular dispersion forces holding the different polymer strands together in the solid break, allowing the strands to slide over one another, resulting in a material that can be remoulded into different shapes. This is in contrast to thermosetting polymers such as bakelite and melamine, which have crosslinks between the polymer strands. These crosslinks are comprised of atoms linked by strong covalent bonds, which are much harder to break. As a result, thermosetting polymers do not soften when heated and are unable to be remoulded once they have set. Polythene is the simplest of a range of thermoplastic polymers that can be created by addition polymerization by varying the monomeric starting units. Vinyl chloride gives rise to polyvinyl chloride, styrene to polystyrene, propene to polypropene, and tetrafluoroethene to Teflon. The plastic materials that result from these different polymers have distinctive properties that lend themselves to use in a wide variety of products, from plastic packaging and containers through to clothing and non-stick fry pans.